Hello friend, welcome back. So in this video, <coughs> sorry, in this video, let's investigate how can we handle images, right? The piece images. Okay, remember we already have um, 12 piece images in my download folder. So we'll put it into Eclipse. So we'll create a, a folder here, um, source folder, folder, um, source folder. Okay, let's create that one. Like uh, resource for the name finish yeah it's here and let's create another one is it source folder um, like image oh no I think we don't need this delete um, Delete source folder, yes. Maybe we need to create a just folder image. Yeah, this is better. So now we can control, uh, we can drag those image and put it here. Copy files, yes. Okay. Now they are here, right? Cool. So we need to load those images into our program before we can uh, draw them. Let's try something here. So we'll use um, class loader, class loader, this one, um, loader equals get class dot get class loader like that. So we use this class loader to create the URL yeah, this guy, URL, resource equals class loader dot get resource. Get resource. Name is the file name. So what is the name? We'll put image slash um, for example, let's do the first the B shop black dot PNG like that. Now let's check if uh, maybe you can use a better name resource URL like that. So if if else if resource URL is is now okay we can print um, failed to load image else let's see um, Let's also show something here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now let's give it a try. Now we don't need this. Okay. So run it. Yeah. Okay. So now if we change, right? That's. 
just for fun let's remove the k from the file name and run again fail to load the image right good so this verify now undo command z yeah to put the k back okay so here we do have the <clears throat> uh url so we can create a file here like file this guy java io dot java dot io dot file so image file equals we can create a file here using the new file that string no we are use this one another constructor url here yeah so this is our uh resource wait a minute uri right is uri so resource url dot to uri yeah, this guy. Now, um, unhandled exception, right? Surrounded with try and catch. Yeah, we can use that. So because this might fail, the UI syntax exception. Okay. So now after we have the file right image file we can use image io to get to create the image like that this one image equals image io io this one read file now we can put the image file in this also right unhandled at surround with catch yeah this one will throw io exception when the reading the reading of the image file fail so now if not if everything is okay now let's use g2 dot draw image draw image let's see which one um, wow this is too long undo draw image maybe the second one or uh, draw image xy color with height what about this one observer we don't need observer Let's put it zero zero, okay? Zero zero and width and height. Uh, let's just use cell side. Cell side. Cell side. Let's see. Run it. Yes. It works right cool so finally we can draw our image on not yet right not yet on the chessboard but yeah anyway so you see there's a few steps to get it done we need to 
yeah put the image file somewhere here so this is inside the um, class path so we we use right we create the um, new we create our source folder so this will be this folder will be found by the class loader class loader so we only need to provide this part of the file name we don't need to put um, res here okay so there are some uh, exceptions to handle here okay um, that's good so we'll continue in our next video to put all the images right on our chessboard see you then thank you for watching